first of all, congratulations. A first Chelsea win for you in the Premier League. How was that for you? No, really pleased. Uh, happy with the performance, solid performance. Happy for the for our fans and for the player and for all the people that work around. Yes, after nine, ten games from last season, that this season that we cannot feel the victory on Stamford Bridge, that is important to build the confidence for all of us and, and to create this good energy in between the fans and the and the player always is important. You mentioned the word energy. The, the energy levels on the pitch felt really high from the first minute today. Yes, I seen that was fantastic. The fans were fantastic. They translate the, the positive energy. That is what we needed. And, and the players were there uh, giving their best. I think the team, uh, perfor the performance was, was good and the commitment the player on the pitch always is fantastic. And that is why we are so pleased. But now it's the first step. We need to keep improving. Uh, we need to be better in all the phases of uh, areas on the, that we need to improve in the, on the team. But it's only a matter of time. Um, we will arrive in, in the moment that we, when we recover all the players also insured. Um, yes, we are going to be. We have a strong squad, and we are very, uh, we are going to be competitive. You spoke about Raheem Sterling last weekend. Just how good was he tonight? No, fantastic. No, he scored. I think he worked really hard. I think yes, fantastic performance. Uh, yes, really pleased for him. And the first goal in Chelsea Blue for Nicholas. I mean, his overall performance today, you must be delighted with. Yes, happy, happy for him. Also, for all the striker and offensive player need to fill the net. And for him, he worked really hard in, in the first uh, few games here against Liverpool and West Ham, but didn't get what he deserved. But today, he deserved to score and score. And always is good. It's big relief for the offensive player when he scores. And finally, a big win today. What does that do for confidence now as we look? Into the field. I mean, two more big home games yeah, in the next seven days. Consistent. Now it's about to be consistent. We have Wednesday and then Saturday, and then is the, the the challenge is to be consistent and, and to keep there the the level that we show today. Uh, the key was to match the desire and the energy that is going to you know to to provide or to going to be in the in the side of uh, in the opponent like uh, Luton, and that was I think was key today after the quality is there. But now the the challenge is. To keep consistent and really work, working really hard to try to improve every day. Raheem, first of all, congratulations! Big win, big performance tonight. How was it for you? Yeah, no, it's massive. Um, as I said, it's it's a good feeling after coming out of last week's disappointed with a game that we don't think we should have lost uh, with a good team performance. But again, we just need to build. Uh, that's a good first win there. And we just need to go again, get another three points, and keep building. Two goals for you. How do you assess your performance personally? Yeah, I said my contribution. Um, you know, is being able to be decisive and help the team in that aspect. And I think from last week, you know, we needed to take our chances and we've done that brilliantly with the first one, the second one, and we just need to keep building. You've looked really sharp so far this season. Are you enjoying your football? Yeah, I'm enjoying my football and you know, that's, that's all I'm focused on is just keep, keep building, step at a time and, and go again. So this game's gone, go again next week. Seems to be a real positive feeling within the group, especially coming from the manager. What has he said to you about your role within the team? Yeah, as I said, the the responsibility is given on to the whole team. You know, um, there's standards that he sets for everyone, and we just need to match those standards. And you know, I don't think he will let that go below par. He won't accept it, and that's what we need um, at this football club. You know, it's high standards here. We're expected to win matches, and we just need to keep keep building, keep going. It's crazy how young a group this is. Do you relish the the, the role of being one of the more senior players within this squad? Yeah, I think, as I said, it's football at the end of the day and I think performances and showing personality, no matter how old you are, um, as long as you're showing personality at a football club like this, you, you know, you've got a big role for the football club and you know, a lot of the boys in there have, have big personality, so we just need to keep building, keep learning um, about each other and, and, and try to build something special. Certainly a lot of personality out on the pitch and in the stands as well. The atmosphere seemed pretty special today, didn't it? Yeah, as I said, um, as, a, as a football club that deserves... These, these victories and victories and victories because they you know they're, they're top supporters and that's what we need to keep giving them to, to for them to help us and we'll, we'll we'll try to do our best on the pitch and, and keep bringing those wins in. Thank, Thank you. you so much. Really appreciate it.